The risk of trading futures and options can be substantial and may not be suitable for all investors. Past performance is not necessarily indicative of future results. In this video, we'll be covering some more advanced bracket types in the Rhythmic Trader Pro order book. Once you have the order book open, you can go to your bracket OCL menu and left click to expand the menu. Then we're going to come over to configure and click configure. With the bracket menu open, you can begin entering your target ticks and target quantity, as well as stop ticks and stop quantity. I'm going to start with an eight tick target and select a one lot order. I can then go in and configure my multiple brackets from the same window. So I'll do a 10 tick target for my second order, and I'll do the same thing on the stop side, setting my first stop eight ticks away for one contract and my second stop 10 ticks away for one contract. You can then call this, we'll title it multi-bracket. Click save and then close it out. Now you're able to select your multi-bracket strategy from the drop-down menu and then make sure you have brackets enabled by left-clicking over the disabled button. Once I have brackets enabled, I can change my order quantity to two since my order involves two separate stops and targets. And then I can come down to a price of 3036.75 and left click on the bid column if I want to place a buy limit order. You can see now I have my working bracket. This is a two contract limit order with a held stop and target and a held limit order on the sell side. These held orders should be sent through once my limit for two contracts is filled. If I want to cancel these, as always, I can right click on the parent order, or I can simply go down to cancel all. One of the cool things with Rhythmic Trader Pro is if you have a multi-bracket configured, but I don't have enough contracts selected in the contract window to fill the full multi-bracket, it'll default to the nearest target and stop. So right now I have the same multi-bracket functionality selected, but I only have one contract entered in the quantity. If I come down to 3037 spot zero and left click to put on a buy order, you'll see that it only takes the nearest target and stop order. I can then cancel this, go back to two contracts and place a limit order at 3037 spot zero. And you can see that I still have my multi-brackets configured. That's the basics of setting up a multi-bracket strategy in Rhythmic Trader Pro.